What is up YouTube? I have my first product review. If you're an Xbox fan, have you ever had the thought of buying an Xbox t-shirt, a sweatshirt, a pin, whatever it might be? Have you ever gone to Microsoft.com? They have a ton of stuff you might not even be aware that they sell, uh, just for your enjoyment, I guess I could say. Now, I've been one of the unlucky souls who've wanted to buy stuff like that as crazy as it might seem, but I've never actually pulled the trigger. Now, that wasn't until Saturday when I was at a TJ Maxx and I stumbled across the greatest, neatest, coolest game room edition for any Xbox fan this Christmas. What I'm talking about today is the Xbox Official Gear Icon Lights. Now, you might be saying, why do you need this? That's a heck of a good question, but you do. Now, inside this box, you're going to see a, I would say, five foot long micro USB cable, which is kind of cool because most of these products that, you know, come out of China or wherever, whatnot, they come with like a two foot USB cable. You just throw that thing, it goes in the landfill. So, tisk tisk. Now, we open the box. Like I said, we get the USB cable and we actually get the unit itself. So it's pretty cool. Um, it's very, you know, it's all plastic, nothing, you know, no good materials. The base isn't metal or anything. Doesn't have much weight to it. Um, the cool thing about it is you can actually power it with the micro USB. And, and let me warn you about these suckers. If you've ever done any Kindle repair or anything like that, these are the first thing to break. So be very cautious if you're doing micro USB to this device. Um, alternatively, you could do th three AAA batteries, which I actually find that pretty cool that they added that in. And then on the back here, we of course have the official Xbox logo. This is made by a company called Paladone and you have a button. So pretty cool and uh, you know, I like it. It's It's been a nice addition. So let's check it out. Let's see if it's something that you think is cool, if you'd be interested in buying it or not. Um, so we're gonna test that next in the next clip. Okay guys, we're back here. We're gonna do one button press and that illuminates the logo and the Xbox text. If we do another click, that's a little bit more of a full effect, I would say. And then the third button press actually flickers the Xbox lettering, so pretty cool. And then the third option is just off. Okay guys, that about wraps it up for the Xbox Icon Lite. This thing is really cool, it has a few different features. You can power it with micro USB, with batteries, which I would say to use. I plugged this in, and it was actually very, very difficult to plug in and made this weird noise. So it does work, so just be careful with that. Now I paid $14.99 for this sucker uh, at TJ Maxx. It retails for $22 apparently. I did look online, it wasn't Microsoft, but it was a different retailer that wanted $34. I would not pay that much for this. It's really kind of chintzy, but it looks cool in your game room and at night if you game with the lights off. It's a really cool addition and, and just fun. So for $14, I would snag one of these. For $22, it would make a great gift to the Xbox fan or gamer that you have in your family. Um, but outside of that, I would never pay $34 for it. I hope you like this. If you've ever purchased anything through Microsoft.com or another retailer that's an official Microsoft product, I'd like to know what the quality of the t-shirts or the sweatshirts are and just what was your all-around experience. If you've enjoyed this video, throw me a like and feel free to subscribe. Thank you guys and as always, have a great day.